Yo, what is up guys? Says Mink here. Today, I'm going to be making a, uh, a bridge overlay from scratch. Um, I'm planning on doing this in about half an hour. So yeah, we'll see how this goes. I, I, my idea for this pack is it's going to be a cotton candy overlay. And once we finish it, I'm going to uh, play some games with it. A uh, pack link will be down below if you want it. But yeah, anyways, let's get into this. Alright, so we're going to start off with the blue clay. Uh, let me turn off the grid lines. Anyways, we'll be starting off with the blue clay. Um, so, because I feel like this one will be the easiest. So what we're going to do is we are going to uh, have to change the hue and saturation. But first I want to get a color palette. So let's do that first, actually. Alright, so I've now got my color palette. I'm going to use the dark color as a kind of an example, but I want the... Uh, Outlines look like maybe if I decide to do outlines or maybe the top layer. That's actually what I'm probably going to do. I don't really want outlines in this pack. Um, that's just personal preference. Maybe I'll make a version with and without. We'll see. And then the top to kind of be what it looks like, the actual block. Yeah, we're going to quickly grab this for the blue clay. And yeah, let's start working on that. Alright, so this is kind of the color I want, but I don't really know how I feel about it. But I guess we'll see when we're in game. Um, let's try getting a green now. Or let's try getting a red clay now. Because it'll be a lot easier to figure out what exactly I want to do once I have more than one. The red clay is going to be more of a pink. So yeah, let's quickly do that. So now we have our two colors. I don't think I'm a big fan of them, but we're going to see first. Because you always want to check them out in-game. Because for all you know, you're, you'll you think they're cool in-game, but think they suck in uh, Photoshop. Alright, so let's quickly see how it looks in-game. You know what, that doesn't look that bad. Honestly, I don't really like the texture of it though. It looks, um, kind of weird. Maybe if I add an outline. Let's see what an outline looks like. Alright, so we now have an slight outline to the blocks. Which looks a little better, I think. Um, we'll kind of see how it works in game. I feel like they're a little too, uh, saturated though. Well, I might want to change down their saturation a little bit. Yeah, because it just kind of feels like it's really, um... Out, you know? Also, I haven't played Minecraft, but they don't judge me. Yeah, the blocks feel kind of just really out of place. And yeah, I'm liking that, like, kind of a lot more. It looks a lot more... It fits everything else a lot more, I think. Yeah, if we go look over here. Yeah, this feels like it fits in a lot better. So we're gonna see how this works in game. Alright, something I'm noticing is I feel like there's a little too much texture to the block. Like, maybe that's just me, but I don't really like how, um, texture it is. Like, the, uh, little, uh, marks. So let me try reducing those. Alright, so I did some stuff in Photoshop, and I'm liking the look a lot in Photoshop, but I guess we have to see in-game. I think it might be a little too bright, so I might decrease its brightness, but... Oh, yeah. That's much better. Oh yeah, that texture is nice. Oh yeah, I love that. Alright. That's cute. Which will be pretty easy. All I'm really going to do is uh, make this black and white. And there we go. We might have to make it a little brighter. Maybe a little darker, but we'll see. Oh yeah, that's nice looking. Alright, alright. I love that actually. That looks really clean. I'm really happy I went in and changed the texture. Alright, so now we've got most of it done. We just need to create a top layer, but let's try uh let's try this out quickly. Yeah, I'm enjoying like holding these blocks a lot more. Maybe that sounds kinda weird, but like you know when you hold your block and you're kinda like seeing how it looks in your hand. Like I like that a lot more now than I did before. But yeah, next up is the uh, top layer. 
Alright guys, um, my recording kind of stopped for a little bit, but basically all I've changed since the last time you saw is I made the, um, the, what is it called, the blue clay a little bit, um, the outline of it a little better, and the uh, texture of it a little nicer. So that's all I've really changed, I haven't done the top layer yet. Alright, so now if I build up here, yeah, alright. So that works. Um, I don't know how I feel about the texture though. It is kind of, um, I think it might be a little too dark. Yeah, I think it might be a little too dark. And I don't know how I feel about the heart. Okay, I'll try it. I'll just scrap the heart. Alright, and yeah, it's a little better. I kind of like that more. Maybe it'll be a little bit darker. Um... Yeah, it might make it a little bit darker soon, but I kind of want to create these other two textures and then we'll see how those look and then we'll base it off of that. All right, so after like 10 minutes of trying to figure out what was going wrong, I finally fixed it. So now it looks like this. All right, so we're going to kind of try this out in game real quick. To see how it looks. Um, and see what things I mess up because I'm pretty sure I messed something up. Okay, first off, I can tell that I used the wrong height. Oh, I used the... Yeah, I used the very wrong height. I used the... <laughs> but one thing I did is I kind of made the bottom layer a little bit brighter to indicate that's the bottom. I don't know if that's cool or not, but I thought it was interesting. Okay, let's see what is the top layer. Oh, it's... Yeah, 99, that's right. Should I go AFK mid game to fix that? Right, I went AFK for a little bit and he's probably gonna like abuse that. Yeah. Okay, so now the top layer should be fixed. It costed me like two goals to do, but who cares? Oops. Imagine I lose because of that. Okay. But yeah, now the top layer is all done and good. Oops. I'm liking the feel of uh, pink team right now. I'm not sure I'll like uh, Aqua though. Or not Aqua. Oh yeah, yeah, I guess. I don't know. It's confusing, man. Oh, I just lagged back. That was so fair. Wow. I love it when I lag back out of their goal. Oh, I was seeing nice lag. I just like got up to check something. And I come back to that. Lovely. Oh, wait. Oops. Oh, yeah, I forgot that like Hypixel's like unplayable right now. A lot of my friends have been complaining about like their ping being like 3000. Oh, what? Okay. Anyways, that's basically this pack. Here's a little slide by of what it looked like in game. As you can see, the bottom layer, it's got that like cool little differentiation uh, in the bottom, which I think is cool. I don't know if you guys will think it's cool, but I think it's cool at least. And here's the same thing with shaders now. Um, still very cool. I really like it. I will probably use this pack sometimes. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want this uh, pack, the download link is in the description. This took me roughly 30 minutes, uh, 45 minutes to create, which is pretty good considering I made it completely from scratch. Like I didn't use any other packs as a baseline or anything like that, unless you count the default Minecraft clay texture as a uh, baseline, but that's about it. Yeah, I think this turned out pretty well. Um, Yeah. Make sure to uh, subscribe if you like this, by the way. It really means a lot. And like the video. Anyways, peace out.